From ancient lizards to million-year-old birds, stay tuned to number one to find out what is the oldest living animal still alive today. Number 10. Crocodiles Perhaps the most obvious prehistoric animal is the crocodile, which even looks like a floor-bound version of a T-Rex. But things evolve and change over time. Just look at photos of your parents from before you were born. But of all reptiles alive today, crocodiles are the least changed. The earlier crocodiles of the Triassic and Jurassic periods had a few design features that didn't stick around for too long. But for the most part, crocodiles have remained exactly the same for 65 million years. Like Conan O'Brien's hair. The Mesozoic era crocodiles developed the three main traits that they are known for, their brand if you will. Stubby legs, sleek bodies, and marine lifestyle. Many people get confused between crocodiles and alligators, but there are subtle differences. For starters, there are 14 known species of crocs, but only two known species of alligators. Crocodiles have more webbing on their feet than alligators and are better at tolerating salt water. And most importantly, you see crocodiles in a while but you don't see alligators until later. Number 9. Sandhill Crane The fact that birds are descended from dinosaurs is a fact as universally acknowledged as humans breathing air. But as the centuries rolled by, they gained feathers and lost some size. It may seem odd to think that the likes of pigeons being part of the same family as T-Rexes, but sometimes the apple does fall far from the tree. To get technical, birds are evolved from a group of dinosaurs known as Manoraptorian theropods. That may sound like gobbledygook from Harry Potter, but Manoraptorian theropods were small meat-eating dinosaurs such as velociraptors. And when you really take a look, birds are more similar to velociraptors than you might think. We would love to be there for that family reunion. One notable example is the Sandhill Crane. Native to northeastern Siberia and North America, some of the oldest known Sandhill Crane fossils date back 2.5 million years, which is much older than any other bird fossil, with another fossil suspected as belonging to a Sandhill Crane going back a remarkable 10 million years. They could get pretty big too, with some of the largest examples having a wingspan of 6 foot 11 inches. Number 8. Chinese Giant Salamander Individually, the Chinese giant salamander can reach as old as 60 years, but there are even undocumented claims of some being as old as 200 years. But as a species, the Chinese giant salamander is the oldest and longest amphibian in the world with some growing as long as 5 foot 9 inches. If it were able to stand up on its hind legs, that would be exactly as tall as Robert Downey Jr., 1 inch taller than Tom Holland and 4 inches taller than Bruno Mars. The Chinese giant salamander's long time on the planet could sadly be coming to an end though. Overcollection of the animal, due to its use in traditional medicines and its meat being considered a delicacy, has left the Chinese giant salamander a critically endangered species. Despite them being so endangered, the criminal penalty for hunting them is surprisingly low, only just 50 yuan, which is a mere $6 US. With their dying out being such a crisis, 14 nature reserves were established in the 80s that focused solely on Chinese giant salamander conservation, but unfortunately, it's been little help. Before we move on, take a second to like this video, and while you're there, be sure to hit that subscribe button below so you can continue to follow us right here at Zero to Hero. Number 7. Martialis Heureka Ant Discovered in the year 2000, the Martialis heureka ant is the actual millennium bug. Remarkably, seeing as they weren't known about until as late as the 2000s, the Martialis heureka ant is estimated to have lurked in the nooks and crannies of the world for as long as 120 million years. It belongs to the oldest known distinct lineage to have diverged from the ancestors of all other ants. The first proof of their existence was found in Germany in the year 2000, but was damaged. A new specimen was not found until 2003 by a graduate of the University of Texas. Their name relates to their appearance looking somewhat Martian, and their orangish coloring and unique features definitely make them look like something out of an old sci-fi movie. Number 6. Horseshoe Crab Its name is something of a misnomer. 
the horseshoe crab actually has more in common with spiders, ticks, and scorpions than any actual crab. Some people change their look every couple of years, maybe a new haircut or a new piercing. But not the horseshoe crab. This little fella has remained unchanged for 450 million years. They discovered their look early and stuck to it. Considering the closest living relative to trilobites, horseshoe crabs are one of the best examples of what experts call living fossils. And if you've ever been accused of being a messy eater, you are nothing compared to the horseshoe crab. Given their lack of a jaw, the horseshoe crab mashes up its prey with its legs before eating. You could argue that they are the most royal creatures on this list because, unlike vertebrates, horseshoe crabs do not have hemoglobin in their blood, instead using hemocyanin. There's a lot of copper in hemocyanin, meaning that horseshoe crabs literally have blue blood. They are also extremely important to medical research. The animal's blood is used in the widely used Limulus amoebocyte lysate, or LAL test, to detect bacterial endotoxins in pharmaceuticals and test for several bacterial diseases. And before you ask, yes, that is just a quote from Wikipedia, and no, I don't know what it means. Number 5. Australian Ghost Shark Australian ghost sharks may sound like the name of a terrifying heavy metal band, but it's actually an alternative name for elephant sharks. If you do something to annoy one, they'll never forget it. These terrifying things have been haunting the seas for over 420 million years. The Australian ghost shark has actually had a bit of an identity crisis and has changed its name a lot, having gone under the names of elephant shark, whitefish, and plowno's chimera. Despite their many names suggesting that they are unbeatable monsters of the sea, not to be tamed by man, they're actually rather goofy looking things and it's common for them to be served up with chips in New Zealand. Number 4. Tadpole Shrimp Tadpole shrimps first started to evolve in the days of dinosaurs and have been found happily still kicking around in little old Scotland. Growing more than 10 centimeters long, the tadpole shrimp has remarkably survived not one, not two, but three major extinctions in Earth's history. Only Keith Richard rivals them for endurance. They lived in temporary pools of water in which they lay eggs. When the pools dry out, the adults die off, but their eggs remain dormant until the pools fill up again. It was researchers at Glasgow University who discovered this wee little critter. They collected samples of mud, dried them out, then made them wet again and placed them in tanks. Two weeks later, a research student spotted one of the shrimps happily swimming in the tank. She said, I hadn't expected to find it and was just going in to check on the heat and lights. It was great to see everyone in the lab gathering around and peering into the tank to look at this ancient survivor from the past. Number 3. Jellyfish Jellyfish are like the comedian Betty White. Millions of years old, but watch out, they can still sting you better than most. Having roamed the seas for 500 million years, and maybe even 700 million, they are the oldest multi-organ animal and probably look down at T-Rexes as cute young whippersnappers. They have been proven to be the most energy efficient swimmers of all animals. Presumably swimming out of the way of danger is how they've survived for so long. Despite jellyfish as a whole having existed for at least 500 million years, each individual jellyfish doesn't quite last so long, with average lifespans being between just a few hours and a couple of months. Number 2. Coelacanth The coelacanth, and no, I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right, is the oldest living lobe-finned fish. They evolved into their current form approximately 400 million years ago. In 1938, the coelacanth was rediscovered after having been thought to be extinct for 66 million years. The coelacanth was believed to have been extinct since the end of the Cretaceous period, but they definitely made an unexpected comeback. There are only two species of coelacanth and both are threatened, currently making it the most endangered animal in the world. Luckily for them, they are at no risk of being eaten because their body produces an excessive amount of oil and their scales emit mucus, making them pretty untasty. Number 1. Tenophora While jellyfish may have loitered around in the oceans for 700 million years, Tenophora definitely have, making them the oldest creature on this list. Known more commonly as comb jellies, they look like translucent, spherical blobs, but Interestingly, those that live deeper in the oceans are more pigmented with one species, 
the Tortuga Red being, well, you guessed it, bright red. The closer they live to the surface, the less likely they are to be colorful. Presumably, the disgusting sight of humans has made them go pell. Despite looking like playful children's balloons of the sea, they are far from friendly. Tenophore are predators and can eat up to 10 times their own body weight in just a single day. Tell us which prehistoric creature you like the most in the comments below, and take care.